is worth 510 pounds. Pretty hefty. I'm just not keen on the scent. I, I just don't know why. It's vibing Christmas. And this is my wreath. been like a minute since I've done one of these unboxing videos before. Welcome back! They are back! Definitely for 2021. Very excited to get my teeth stuck into next year because let's be honest 2020 has not been the most great year for everyone. Before I jump into the unboxings I kind of want to start this video off a little bit differently and I might do it going forward. So at the start of this video I'm actually going to use some of the products that I got from the subscription boxes that I've just unboxed and I'm going to give myself a little bit of a pamper just to kind of show you guys how you can use the products and how I like to use the products. I don't know I just thought it was a little bit more interesting. Let me know if you like the new style. Talking of unboxings I really want to show you guys the Pantene hair biology range. So I have this little set here and I'm going to box it for you guys because you know that I'm struggling with my hair right now. I'm trying to grow it. I'm trying to make it much more healthier and I'm definitely going to give Pantene a go. Here I have the cleanse and reconstruct range. So this is ideal for those of you who have a greasy root like me but with thirsty ends. So inside we obviously have products but first of all we have the cleanse and reconstruct intensive repair mask. So this little beauty is meant to instantly help with damaged hair which has been caused by external factors such as hair styling and I certainly do that a lot. What it will do help to penetrate into the hair and also helps to prevent signs of damage such as breakage and also split ends. Inside you've got rose water, you've got micellar and you've also got pro v nutrients. It's also paraben free, free from colorants and also minerals and it smells bloody amazing oh my gosh with these kind of products if i'm in a rush i like to damp my hair and leave it in for five to ten minutes and then wash off but if i want like a really intensifying treatment i actually damp in my hair pop it in, shove a shower cap on and actually go to sleep in it. The shampoo, I really like this shampoo because it's a lightweight shampoo. So it's perfect for a greasy root, but it also helps to nourish the ends as well. So this is also again infused with rose water. So it helps to purify, calm and soothe. It's also a silicon free shampoo, which is really, really important to me. It's something that I always look out for in hair shampoos. Lathering this into my hair is an absolute dream. Again, the smell, the smell just smells, oh my God, incredible. And also what I like about it is that your hair smells good for a couple of days. I mean, it's a really nicely scented shampoo. Then to go with the shampoo, of course, we do have a spot of conditioner. So this has also got micellar and also rose water inside. Again, this is really good on the root. It isn't too greasy, so it won't weigh your hair down. This is also a paraben, silicon and colorant free conditioner as well. My hair after use feels like really like, how can I put it? Like soft and like airy like it just feels like it's got like an oomph of life to it. I'm going to give myself a bit of a pamper time using the products that I've just received from Pantene and also some of the products that I got in the subscription boxes so enjoy this next bit. minute since I've unboxed one of these subscription boxes but I'm so glad that we're back but I'm gonna start with I think I'm gonna start with glossy box this time for those of you who do not know glossy box costs 10 pounds per month now every single box the value is always around 50 pounds which is 
amazing. Sometimes it's way over 50 pounds. Every single month they have a theme. This one is Christmas. On the front it says best time of the year, which I totally agree with. First up, we have something by Palmer's. I absolutely love Palmer's. It smells beautiful. Now this is the Vitamin E Soften Smooth Relieves Rough Dry Skin for 24 hours and it's basically a cocoa butter. Honestly, it smells just like chocolate like freshly melted chocolate. This is really good to pop on dry patches on the skin, on the face. It's quite multi-purposeful. Next up, we got something by Wonder Beauty and this is the Baggage Claim Gold Eye Mask. This is really good for dull and tired skin. So it's really good to inject a bit of hydration and life under the eye. We have a beauty blender next. So this is by Sport FX and this is Blend and Go. So this has an angle tip so it's perfect to get around the eye. Next up we have something by Nailberry. This is a really good nail brand by the way and this is Auctionated Nail Lacquer and this is in the colour Strawberry Jam. It's vibing Christmas. And then finally, we got something by Symbiosis London. I've never tried this before, but this is an overnight rejuvenating eye serum. So that is everything by Glossy Box. I do actually have some discount codes, which I'll leave down in the description. So go and check it out. Moving on to Look Fantastic. Now this one is slightly more expensive per month. It is 15 pounds, but I have to admit, I really do love a Look Fantastic box. I really like the design of this month's box. It's very festive. We've got little baubles and we have a spot of gold. I love a bit of gold during these festivities. At first, we got something by Medic 8. This is a very expensive brand. Now this is the Liquid Prehydration Serum. So this is very anti-agent and it's also jam-packed with hyaluronic acid. Hyaluronic acid is very moisturizing for the skin without feeling oily. Next, we have an eye brush. Now this is by Brushworks and this is the double-ended eye brush. This is perfect for applying on like maybe some sparkly eyeshadow whereas the other end is really good for filling out the eyebrow or just applying a color along the waterline. Next we have Avant. Now Avant again is a very expensive brand. Now this is the Pro Radiance Brightening Eye Final Touch. This is so expensive. It's also jam-packed with hyaluronic acid and also collagen which again is great for moisture and two good for aging and those fine lines. Then we got something by Jekka Black. Now this is Glow Drops and this is highlighting primer for the face. It's vegan friendly, cruelty free and it's in the color champagne. So this is something good to use if you want more of a dewy finish. What you do, you apply it to the skin and then pop your makeup on top. And then finally we have something by The Balm and this is Petal to the Metal and it's a cream eyeshadow. The consistency really does look and feel like a balm and the color is like a champagne rose gold color. If I'm honest with you, I'm not really overly keen on these kind of like balm eyeshadows that just make my lids feel really like icky. That is everything inside look fantastic this month. Again, if I've got any discount codes, I'll pop down in the description, but I've also left the link down there too. Lift, lift, lift the link down there. My goodness, I am really gonna cover the best one next, I think. So we're gonna move on to the Harper's Bazaar award winners beauty box. Now this is just 125 pounds, but the contents inside, wait for it, is worth 510 pounds. This will make the perfect Christmas gift for someone. Pretty hefty. I think I'm gonna quickly whiz through this box because we have a lot inside. First up, we have something by Benefit and this is Gimme Brow and this is the Brow Volumizing Fiber Gel. This is a really good product if you, I don't know, just wanna be a bit lazy and you just want a little bit of something for your eyebrow, this is very good. Then we have Face Halo and this is the Modern Makeup Remover. Oh, it's basically like a reusable pad so that you can not use cotton pads and be uh, very bad on the environment. You could be better on the environment with this because you can easily clean them in the washing machine. We have nail polish. This is a really nice color. So this is an OPI one, so very fancy. This is infinite shine and this is in the color. You can count on it. Then we have a little mascara. So this is by Guerlain and this is the new mascara 
mad eyes. So the wand looks super bushy. Oh my god, I'm all about this wand. Then we got something by Dr. Seba, and this is a very pricey brand. And this is the Vitamin C Brightening Primer, SPF 15. I have actually been using his um, Vitamin C powders and popping them into moisturizers. Game changer, my skin looks and feels a lot better. So I'm very excited to pop this underneath, probably makeup. It's smoothing, it's illuminating, and it's also protecting because it has the SPF 15 inside. Then we have something by Heyou, and this is the Body Restorer Massage Tool. <gasps> oh my goodness, a massage tool? Oh, okay. Oh, this looks really fancy. I'm actually gonna gift this to Joe, and hopefully he'll give me a massage with it. Then we have something by Physical, and this is the Most Clinically Research Maximum Strength Hair Growth Supplement. <gasps> Oh my goodness, you guys know that I'm trying to grow my own hair. So apparently this has um, 30 tablets inside, so a month's supply, and it helps maintain normal health or he blah, 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 healthy hair growth from within. Oh my god, this is something that I need. Then we have got the Inky List, and this is the Silasic Acid Cleanser. Apparently this helps to reduce um, blackheads and breakouts, so very good if you have congested skin. Then we have a Joe Loves Little Cat candle and this is white rose and lemon leaves. Mmm, you could definitely smell the rose in there. Something by Shiseido next and this is the Color Gel Lip Balm. <gasps> I think it's something red, it is! Oh my gosh, something red. It's basically like a tinted um, lipstick, like a tinted balm lipstick. My goodness, this box is never ending. Right, so we have a face mask next and it's an Estee Lauder one and this is Advanced Night Repair. Oh, it's got two steps to it. You've basically got a chin bit and then you've got a top bit. You only need to leave it on for 10 minutes but apply it to clean skin just before you go to bed. Then we've got something by Balance Me and this is Beauty Sleep Hyaluronic Acid Mist. Hyaluronic acid is really good for hydration and this is something that I would pop on last before going to sleep. Your skin at night does its repairing so it's really good to have some additional support. Then we have something by Kate Somerville next and this is the Recovery Cream. It feels incredibly light, oh my goodness. I've actually tried this before and it's a really good not too overpowering, like over oily moisturizer. Good for every day. Then we've got something by Dr. Barbara Strum. Wow, they've got the names in this box. And this is the Calming Serum. So if your skin is feeling irritated and stressed, this will help to kind of bring those levels in your skin back to normal. It says it helps to reduce redness and burning. Next, we have an anti-wrinkle product and this is by Strivectin and this is Intensive Eye Concentrate for Wrinkles. So this apparently intensely reduces the appearance of dark circles, wrinkles, around the eye. I promise we're on to the last two products now, but this is by Alpha and this is Vitamin C with Grapeseed. So what I would do with this product it is like a little drop product. So what I would do is wear it underneath a moisturizer, apply it to the skin and then gently rub in. This also does have hyaluronic acid inside, so it's very hydrating and Vitamin C is incredibly brightening for the skin. It improves radiance, elasticity and skin texture. The last thing we have is something by Aesop and we have got Citrus Melange or Melange Body Cleanser. It's purifying and what does it smell like? It really smells citrusy. That's actually quite nice. That is everything inside the Hearst Beauty Box for this month. I reckon this is going to fly off the shelf. So if you want to get your hands on one, link down below. Next, we are going to take a look at Rockerbox. So Rockerbox is also £10 per month. So it is an affordable one. Next, we have a Balance Me product and this is the Vitamin C Repair Serum. We've discussed a lot about Vitamin C in this video already. It's very brightening, so really good for dull looking eyes. Then we got something by Bella PS Cosmetics and this is the Heat Wave Highlighting Palette. We do have a collection of champagnes, golden colors, 
really good for the spring. Then we have a little sleeper mask. If I'm honest with you, I don't actually use these. Um, maybe I should start using them. And then finally, we got something by Grace and Stella, and this is the Dead Sea Mud Mask. This is amazing at drawing impurities out from the pores, so really good if you've got congested skin. And this one in particular, you don't actually have to leave it on for that long. Let it dry for 15 minutes and then rinse off. So that is everything inside Rockerbox for this month. I'll leave the link down in the description if you want to get yourself one. Birch box. Let's see what's inside you this month. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but over the last few months, Birch Box have changed their packaging for their subscription boxes. So this month we have a really pretty velvety emerald green makeup bag. I'm obsessed with this. I think it looks really pretty. Oh, we do have a range of goodies. Let's start with the first one. So this is a Morning Glory and this is by Han and this is a hydrating hand sanitizer. I just love how thin it is. That will go really nicely into like a jean pocket. Smell test. It just smells like hand sanitizer if I'm honest with you. Then we do have some eyelash curlers. I mean, if you are a subscription box and an advent calendar fan, I mean, you probably have received around 100 eyelash colors by now. And then we got something by Lacoste and this is the charcoal exfoliating and cleansing pad. This is really good for pore cleansing. So if you've got congested skin again, this is gonna be really good. Then we have got an eyeliner. Is this an eyeliner? It is, it's by Ico. And this is, that's where I draw the line eyeliner. And then finally we have a little quad palette to finish off with. So this is by Chella and this is Hello Beautiful and this, this palette is actually really pretty. You've got two nice shimmery shades, we've got gold, we've got silver and then we've got two nice matte shades. So all in all, we got seven products this month, I think. Yeah, seven if you count the little bag as well. And that's also £10 per month. And then finally, I'm gonna do some wreath making. I do actually have a class which is gonna start in 10 minutes. So I thought that I would vlog that next bit to show you. But this is um, by Wreath Making Delivered. I think that's the business name. If not, I'll pop the link to them down below with the correct name. I'm very excited to make a wreath for my front door. So I'm gonna take you along to that. Okay, ready for wreath making. I've taken all the stuff out of the box. There was a lot in this box. Um, yeah, gonna start my uh, my class now. Okay, this bit up here was a bit bare, so I'm feeding in my eucalyptus here. But this just starts to fill it out and give it a bit of texturing and layering. And obviously the eucalyptus is really gorgeous. And, and this is my wreath. It looks, I think it looks quite good for a first ever attempt. Uh, so I made, candy cane heart, I put baubles on it, I put these lovely little snowflake um, baubles, a little ribbon, I tried making a little bow, I mean it is my best attempt, but what do you guys think? Comment below. There we go guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video, don't forget to go and check out the Pan 10 products, link down below. But as always guys, please make sure that you link, like and subscribe and I'll see you next time for another video, bye!